Hi guys, my name's Tara. Um, I just want to get on here and tell you guys a little bit about my backstory and what God's done for me. So most people that don't know me don't know my backstory, but they see me happy. I'm, I'm always happy. I have the joy of the Lord, but like I said, what people don't know is I've been in the streets up until about a year ago, year and a half ago, I was in the streets. My house burned down, ended up out there, but I've been molested. I've been raped. I've been beaten. I've been abused. I, I tried to commit suicide. Cut my wrist the right way. Um, I was in gangs. I've had guns pulled on me. And whatever you can think of, pretty much I've been through it. But, you know, I, I finally hit rock bottom. You know, God's got a, a funny way of <laughs> making you turn to Him. I tried to turn into other things, and I promise you those other things are not it. So when I had nothing else to go to, I finally get humbled myself and, and I came to church. And off and on throughout my childhood and throughout the years, I had been to church a little here and there, but it was always with somebody else on somebody's own accord. Well, when I hit rock bottom and I walked into the stores here at the Moo Church on my own accord, that's when God really came in and touched me. <laughs> And every time the doors were open, I came to church. Any event they had, I was there. So when God seen that I was taking him seriously, he started taking me seriously. <laughs> he has done so much for me. Listen guys, if you are lost or you're going through grief or depression or you're just hurt, I'm telling you, I know a man who could take it all away. <laughs> He can make you happy. He can, he can mend your heart. He can give you joy, true joy, perfect love. Um, I started coming here to the Move Church. I actually came with the next boyfriend a while back. But uh, like I said, when I came in on my own accord and these people loved on me. And I mean, when I came in, they didn't judge me. They didn't, you know, they just loved me. They loved people. And, and that made a huge difference. If it weren't for them and if it weren't for Jesus, I wouldn't be here today. So in closing, I would like to say a quick prayer for anybody who's watching. So if everybody would, just close your eyes. Dear Lord up in heaven, Heavenly Father, I've been where some of these people have been. And I feel the hurt that I remember the hurt, dear Lord. I ask you to touch them and you to heal them, dear Lord. Touch their life. Let them know. Let them feel you, Jesus. You are the only thing that is going to heal them. You are the answer to the, anything that they need, dear God. I ask that they just reach to you and they start taking you seriously, Lord. I ask you just to heal them like you did me. You do not love me any more than you love them, dear Lord. So what you have done for me, you can do for them. 